Hey guys, welcome to the VW Nut Garage. Let's uh, show you what we're going to get into today. So here are the pieces we're going to need. That's a Volkswagen Thing hood. That's a Super Beetle bumper. Uh, a while ago, me and my friend Musty One bounced some ideas off of each other. And uh, we're going to see how far we take this. So I'll get you guys set up and then... Uh, I'll get to uh, showing you what's happening. All right, guys. So here we go. Patina, get over here. Patina, come. Patina, come. Patina, come. Patina's trying to take herself for a walk. Alright guys, so let's get started so we can finish. I think that thing hood's gonna make a great awning. And I think that the bumper, in some fashion or another, is going to make good brackets to hold the awning there. Um, so, we'll bring you guys along as I figure it out. But for right now, it's just a uh, large mouse trap. Be careful. All right guys, so I'm gonna grab that there uh, Super Beetle bumper. And kind of just hold her up around there and see what it looks like and see what I can come up with without knocking this here uh, thing hood on my head. But I figure I better turn on the camera just in case it does fall on my head because that will make for great, great movies. Well, for right now, it looks like the uh, Super Beetle bumper gets to stay a bumper for right this second. We're going to do a little bit of shopping and see what else we can come with, up with. Patina's out there in the yard somewhere. Here she comes. Watch out. Watch out. There she is. Can you guys hear all these birds? like being in the jungle. Alright guys, so let me give you a view of, uh, here's prototype number one. That's a uh, Volkswagen Beetle brake shoe. And I think that's going to be a little bit easier, way better for holding that up there than that heavy ass Super Beetle bumper. That will make a great boat anchor or a great bumper for the Redneck Tractor. Oh, that's a good idea. Bumper for the Redneck Tractor for sure. All right, guys, so here's an update on where we've got so far. Um, like I said, we scrapped the bumper idea. Uh, the brake shoes are mint. They work great. 
I integrated a uh, single port intake because I'm single port for life. And there's another brake shoe over there. Um, I am going to run a small piece of pipe out of here to here. And that should hold everything up. Um, it's already crashed down on my head one time without being on a movie. Uh, but, you know, whatever. Just my head. Super happy with uh, how it turned out. Looks phenomenal. Hanging out of my door. One Volkswagen thing hood awning. All right, I got to go cut that pipe. So anytime I fire up this saw, um, I got to bring you guys with me. I love this saw. I have clean the shop again because it's a mess. Just from, who knows, projects? Things. From doing things. And cut that piece of pipe right there. Perfect. All right, guys, we'll get that pipe put up in the uh, thing and uh, move the door and see if it'll hold itself up. All right, guys, so there it is with the pipe in it. Not sure if I, not sure if I like that or not. Um, it's good for now. It's uh, it's good and stable, so shouldn't fall down, and we shouldn't get a snow load on it. Uh, this year it's metal, and I did give her a little cattywampus in so in case it did want to uh, rain up there it'll come right off um, but super happy being a Volkswagen nut and having that as my awning is awesome um, we'll get back at you guys if I decide to bolt the carburetor up there or something alright guys so uh, I got the tractor out because I'm gonna go uh, I don't know get stuck but there it's the finished product. That I am happy with. All Volkswagen parts, uh, except for the hardware. Lag bolts are holding the uh, intake up there, which is holding all of the weight. The brake shoes are just holding it from going left and right. Um, that's where I'm gonna leave it for now. We'll see what it morphs into. Um, but that makes me super happy. Uh, thanks for coming by the VW Nut Garage today, guys, and we'll see you soon.